160. Oh no, we're doing a backflip. Oh, can we land a backflip? Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome back to some more Beam NG Drive. Um, I am still sick, so I apologize for the voice again. I, I'm trying to get over this as fast as I can. It's super annoying. Anyway, leave a like for sick Neil. No, you don't have to. Anyway, uh, today we're going to be messing around with the Bolide, one of the most uncontrollable cars in the game. But there has been a pretty neat little mod that I just wanted to show off. I don't know if this is going to be a full-length video. This might just be a... BMG quickie, but we're gonna take a look at it. We're gonna take a look. We're gonna take a look at it anyway. So if we look down here, we'll see one called a go kart. And really, this thing doesn't resemble a bolide at all, except for being super wide, super thick. But it is pretty awesome. It's called the Bolide Go Kart, and it comes to us from Peter Bemo. Love that name, by the way. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, start this up. Let's actually go for a different color. I don't really like the banana yellow, so let's not go with a. I don't know, like a matte, like a, I don't know, just a bright blue, kind of like a, my channel colors, I guess. All right, cool. The color selector in this game is still broken, so we have to go all the way up here just to change the friggin' color of the car. So, is this working? Yes, it's working. Okay, so let's go like right around there. A teal color looks good to me. And just look at this. This is, I can already tell that this is probably going to be the fastest go kart to ever go kart. But yeah, I don't know if you would actually consider this a go kart. Because it's basically just the frame of the bolide with the engine complete. Uh, but yeah, with like a roll cage. So I guess technically it's a go-kart, but <laughs> not really. Anyway, let's go ahead and see how she drives. I mean, I'm pretty sure I know how it's going to drive because uh, if you've never driven a bolide in this game, there, uh, there's something, a late 80s supercar, no traction whatsoever. But this thing seems to be doing pretty damn good. And it's actually pretty damn fast. But how's it going to corner... Oh, actually not that bad. I mean, I wasn't going 100 miles an hour into that turn or anything. Let's actually try that. Oh, oh, yeah, yep, 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 yep. That's what I expected. Oh, man, that tire just snapped in half. Oh, wow, nice little bounce we have going on there. It's so weird seeing just the uh, bare bones bolide like this. The engine now, that is so sexy, man. But can we put a bigger engine in? That's what I want to know. So we're going to go over to the vehicle configurator and let's go to the chassis. Uh, engine, and we have a 3.2 liter V8 in it right now. Can we go up to a 4.2 liter race V8 engine? Holy shit. Okay, I'll try that. Is it gonna? Oh, yes. Look at that. Okay, this might be, it was hard to control at first. It might be completely uncontrollable at this point. Can we change anything else on this? I mean, besides all the regular stuff, I'm not really sure. Additional modifications, the Juveloco Mad Bolide mod. Oh, wait, what does this do again? I don't think it actually did anything to us, but I think that's for a different mod. But can I, uh, I'll change the exhaust. I don't like those four puny ones. Let's go with the big one, man. I want the big one. There we go. Okay, now we have a vehicle. This is, this is truly the ultimate go-kart. Okay, let's see how, how she controls. Oh, okay. A little bit of tire spin there. It's okay, though. No problems whatsoever. And, uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yep. <laughs> Might be a little bit too much power there. Let's go ahead and... Yeah, we're going to have to take this very slow. Can the, what's the first person looking like? Oh, yes! We have a beam straight in our face. You know, that's exactly how uh, it is driving a car for me in real life. Because I am six foot four in real life. So, basically, when I'm first in line at the stoplight, I cannot see the stoplight. Because uh, I'm just staring into my <laughs> my rear view mirror, basically. So, this is this is hitting me on a deep level, right? This is connecting with me on a deeper level right here. It sucks being tall sometimes. I mean, there's perks. There's definitely perks. You know, I can reach stuff when I'm at the grocery store. I can reach stuff up on my pantry. But, uh, yeah, there is some downsides, like people asking if I play basketball all the time to not being able to see, to see stoplights and stuff like that. You know, but I, I wouldn't trade it for the world. I like being tall. I don't know what this has to do with this video, but let's go off-road. Or not off-road. Let's go off the beaten path here into... Oh! <laughs> into the tree lovely so yeah the creator has said that he does want to do some more work on the interior because it's pretty much just the uh, the bowl line cut out and placed on this uh, for well actually it's not cut out it's just this exact same frame I believe he does want to model it to look a little bit more like it would fit in a vehicle like this but to be honest I don't care too much but this is just one of those really awesome mods that's just kind of fun to mess around with 
And uh, yeah, I hope I hope more people make stuff like this. It's always fun to check out just the uh, just the little mods. Not you you know it's fun to mess around with all the planes that shoot heat seeking rockets and stuff like that. But when it really gets to the core mechanics of this game. This is where the bread and butter of BMG is car modifications and wrecking said cars. Okay, we're, here's the straightaway. Let's see how fast we can get this bitch without spinning out here. So how fast are we going? 100 miles an hour, not bad. But well, there's a turn. No. Oh god. Oh 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 no. That's not good. Okay, so let's go to the good old drag strip and see how fast we can actually get. Actually, you know what? Let's go to the salt flats. I feel like that's the best place to test top speeds because there's nothing you can run into for miles around. Why does it spawn me on this like random island over here? Every time I every time I spawn in this map, I don't know why the uh, default location is over there, but it's a pain in the ass because I have to spawn the car all the way over here every single time. Just a a small complaint, but I'm still I'm just happy that this is map that this map still works because after there's an update for BMG, half the mods just cease to work. It's a pain in the ass, but it's just something we have to deal with for those sweet sweet BMG updates, which are which are scarce to say the least. This game has like <laughs> I mean, it, there's some games that up, update the game like every other week, but BMG is like nope, we'll do it every six months. How about that? But they're usually pretty good, so I can't complain. Anyway. Let's go ahead and get the bull light up and run in here. And I kind of want to do, you know, there ha already has been a, a, a couple go karts here: the super go kart, the super GTR super kart, and uh, just the GT kart. But I think this is my favorite aesthetically because this, there's nothing going to protect you if you flip over. But anyway, let's go ahead and spawn up the go kart here and see how fast she'll go. Alrighty, here we go. We don't even have any any lights on this thing. This is this is strictly for daytime use. But I think it'll be okay. We're gonna try this with just the default engine. That it was meant to have at first. And I I, I I guess it's just the regular bull light engine, so it's basically gonna go as fast as a bull light is gonna go. But I don't think I've ever tested the top speed of the bull light. I'm guessing around 120, 130 is where it's gonna top out here. Oh, okay, we're already going 135. Wow. Okay, what is this gonna top out at? Maybe maybe 160, 150? I don't know, man. It is an 80s supercar, so you know the sky's the limit, I, I guess. This thing just keeps going, man. We're almost at 160 now. Can we break 200? I don't think so, but we're just gonna see. We have a ton of land left, so we should we should be okay at least for a while. I think it's about to top out at about 170, though. Oh wait, no, it's not. It's still going, man. How fast can this go? Like, can it just keep going until the engine blows, or what? It's got something's got to. Oh wait, we just topped out. Okay, 173 miles an hour. That is not bad. That is extremely fast, man. That is quick as hell. I'm kind of surprised. And, you know, it doesn't really make sense that the uh, sound gets muffled when we're inside this thing. There's nothing at all. I think my head, if this did have a ceiling, my head would be going through it because this car is very, very low to the ground. But yeah, 173 miles an hour. Look how low to the ground this bitch is. Can we drift it? Can we drift the go-kart? Here we go. Oh yeah, there we go. Wow, you can actually drift it pretty easy. Not bad at all. Okay, so let's put the super powered engine in this and see if we can at least drive it first of all and then see how fast we can go. I'm guessing well past 200 miles an hour, but you never know. It could go 300 miles an hour. Who knows? Anyway, we got the uh, 4.2 liter race engine in this bitch and we're gonna have to take it slow at the beginning just so we do not spin out. But yeah, this thing gets up and going, man. As long as we have the... Uh, the grip we should be okay so I'm just slowly pushing down the accelerator and we're already at 120 holy shit 140 miles an hour let's just keep it going fellas oh wow I think we might break 200 here boys yes keep it going yes 200 miles an hour in a go-kart it is a supercar go-kart to be to be fair here but yeah, we're gonna. Oh no, the oil's overheating. Oh no, we're gonna drive it until it explodes. Mark my words. I think we're actually topping out at about 220, 218, somewhere around there. But yeah, we broke the 200 mark, so I'm pretty happy. I guess it's not gonna overheat now. <laughs> can we flip it? Can we pop the tires? Anything? Can we do a 360? Oh yes! Come on, keep it going, keep it going. Oh no, everything broke. Everything broke. <laughs> oh shit. Oh no. Can we keep going? Oh yeah, we're good. I, it's, I thought the engine stopped, but I guess not. So yeah, this thing is pretty damn quick, I gotta say. 
All right, experiment time. I want to try something. Uh, since I still have it downloaded, I really, really hope this mod still works. But the bullet, we have an addition of the bullet that has a giant ramp on the front, and I want to see if I'm going full speed and run into this thing, if we can get some major, major air time. So we're going to go ahead and spawn one of those up right now. Oh, uh, where's the bullet? There it is. So yeah, we're going to spawn up the funny jumper, and please still work. Please still work. Yes! She lives! Okay, so, ooh, where is my car? I'm guessing it's over here somewhere. All right, so we're going to need to spawn up the good old AI menu again. And if this works the first try, if this works the first time, I'm going to be super, super happy. So, spawn up the AI. There we go. Oh, shit. Yeah, okay, there we go. All right, so, we're going to set you to chase me. There we go. There's only two cars, I believe. So, oh, wait, no, there isn't. Oh, shit. Okay, hopefully that's the right car. I forgot that that, tr that random-ass truck just spawns there. So, I think I see it off in the distance here. Come on, render distances. Work with me here. I think I, think I see it, though. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Hopefully he's not going towards the other truck. I would be... Oh, there he is. There he is. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, it's gonna work! Oh! Oh, <laughs> Oh, no, I thought that was good. Whoa, we're still running. How the hell are we still driving? We are on fire. Our car is significantly shorter. I, I don't understand the physics of this at all. But, yeah, that was a catastrophic failure. Uh, I think we were just going way too fast, to be completely honest. All right, let's try that one more time. Maybe a little bit slower this time. So I'm just going to keep it steady. Maybe 100 miles an hour. I think that'll be okay, right? No, maybe 70. Here's just keep it steady. Where are you? Where are you, champ? I know you're coming. I know you're here somewhere, you bitch. Oh, there you are. There you are. Okay, let's keep it. Oh, steady, steady, steady. Slow motion. Yeah! Kind of worked. Holy shit. Oh, yeah, it did work. We're going way up in the air. And we, la <laughs> and we landed on our tires, and he's coming back for more. Uh-oh. I broke your ramp, though, man. Broke it right in half. Apparently, we bu burst into flames as well. Yeah, you can't even hit me now. <laughs> Alrighty, so as is tradition with every new car mod that we get, we're going to take this thing off the car jump arena. Now, I feel like if we get this thing to full speed, we might be able to break the 400, maybe even the 500 mark here, but I don't know how this thing's going to do, uh, do in the air. It can just do tons of backflips for all I know. Anyway, let's just gun it. 160. Oh, no, we're doing a backflip. Oh, can we land a backflip? Holy shit, no! Oh, we were so close. Wow, we kind of landed it. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, we're bouncing. Oh, no. Oh, no, this is not good. Oh! <laughs> wow, we almost landed a friggin' backflip. I kind of want to try that again just to see. What if I push the brakes? Will I do a front flip? Oh, no. Let's try it out. Let's try it out. If I could land a front flip in this thing, that would be the... the, the the, the best trick I've ever pulled off. Okay. Oh, yes. Yes, it's working. Oh, slow down, slow down. No. Oh, there goes our tires. Oh, that was so close to landing it. And here comes the flips. Yes. Out of the pool. And we're going to wrap ourselves around this pole. Lovely. All right, take two. I want to land this front flip, man. This would be like the coolest thing ever. So let's try this again uh, smash down the brakes okay oh this is looking good looking good looking good yes we landed it oh i mean we're a little bit screwed up here but we landed it we landed it fam i say fam oh, <laughs> don't downvote me anyway okay i want to do one more thing that was pretty awesome but i want to do one more thing just for shits and giggles here so we're gonna go down all the way and we're gonna actually we're actually gonna slow down the the physics here and I want to mess around with the fun stuff, so let's go ahead and slow it down. Oh, shit. Slow it down. And let's go to fun stuff. And I want to see how many pieces this, this can break into. Probably not that many. Yep, just the, t <laughs> just the tires. Oh, no. Let's, let's go ahead and explode it as well. So, fun stuff. Boom. No! We landed in the pool. I guess that's... Uh, the way it was meant to be. Anyway, guys, I think I'm going to end this video here. I will leave the link to this uh, to this mod in the description down below. Go ahead and check it out. It's a lot of fun. And, uh, yeah, go ahead and check me out on Twitter as well, at Neological underscore. I have not a lot of... I think I just hit a 1,000 uh, followers on Twitter, which 
Uh, if you compare it to my YouTube, it's not a lot, so I could use all the help I could get on that front. I just kind of shit post on there, but it's still a good time. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye.